The summer solstice is tomorrow, marking the official start of summer, and it's actually the earliest one within nearly 300 years. It's been a while and 12 news meteorologist Lauren Rainson is joining us now with how the summer solstice really differs from the meteorological start of summer. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning. You know, the start of summer. OK, it really doesn't mean a whole lot for us here in Arizona because, yes, it's been really hot, but you've probably heard of several different starts to summer. So let's go over those. The solar summer that runs May 7th through August 5th, and that's when the sun's intensity is the strongest. The unofficial start of summer falls on Memorial Day, and this year that was on May 27th. We came off of meteorological summer on June 1st, and that's based on the monthly temperature trends. And now astronomical summer begins tomorrow, June 20th, and that's based on the position of the Earth relative to the sun. So this time of year, the sun's journey, it's about to end its northernmost point, and after tomorrow, then the sun will begin its southern journey. So tomorrow is going to be the longest day of the year, and for us here in Arizona, we will get 14 hours and 23 minutes of daylight at 1.50 p.m. That's when that direct 90 degree sunlight will be shining over the Tropic of Cancer in the northern hemisphere before jogging back south and our days will trend shorter through December.